welcome to its traffic in today's video i'm going to explain some c programming or c programs welcome to its traffic in today's video i'm going to explain some c program which is uh, based on pattern and have to find their submission here these programs are requested by lucky sinha on my telegram channel if you also have any other questions you can post in my group definitely i'll try to answer it the first question is find the summation of 12 plus 22 plus 32 plus 42 plus and 2 now you see here each time the value is uh, increased by 10 and uh, means at first it was 12 then 22 then 32 and so on so how we'll do this let's move to the c editor or compiler first we'll open codings in c app in our mobile even you can do the same program in your computer also by default this code will appear here i'll remove it return zero is required so we can keep it now we'll write take the variable int and then i and one more sum equal zero as we are doing sum that's why zero if we do multiply then we have to take it as one otherwise the answer will be one now we have to take the value of n from user for that we will write printf enter the value of n then slash n now we have to read the value so for that scanf in scanf we will write percent %d because we are accepting integer value and we will store it in variable n so n percent n now we have to write uh, for loop for we will write i equal n oh sorry i equal 1 then i less than equal to n then i plus plus now we'll put curly braces to write the statement for the loop now here we'll write sum equal now see we have to plus each time 10 20 and so on how we'll get not so how we'll get now 10 we'll get 10 1 into 10 equal 10 so we will write here first i into 10 then after that we will plus 2 here because 12 so 2 then again we have to add it with sum so first we will write sum plus and inside the bracket we will add 10 in i into 10 plus 2 means first time it will be 12 second time it will be the i value will be 2 2 into 10 20 20 plus 2 22 and so on as the question 22 32 42 and like that now we have to display the output for sum so we'll write printf statement printf the summation is percent t and it is available in the variable sum so this is the code for the first question now let's run it the value of n let give a small number 2 so now my number is 12 plus 22 12 plus 22 how much will get it's uh, 34 so my program is correct now let's move to the second question now our pattern is 13 23 33 43 and 3 now see here it's similar just what happened here in place of 3 the number is 
uh, in place of 2 the number is 3 so we don't have to think much about just we'll do little changes here for question b we'll just do little changes and after it we can do it so what changes we'll do in place of add 2 we will write it here 3 now let's run the program value of n let's give it as 2 the answer is 36 means first time it was 13 and second time it is 23 if we add both we will get 36 so this will be the answer for question number 2 now let's move to the question number 3 or question number C 1 now here see the pattern 1 into 2 2 into 3 3 into 4 means the first number is 1 2 3 and the second number is 2 3 4 and so on it's going on so how we will do it let's do it we will do here only so first we'll cut this part because only this part will change here in inside the bracket we'll put a bracket inside the bracket we will write first n n will be at uh, sorry i i will be at first one only so one into then the next number should be two so how we will make it to i plus one so again inside bracket we will write i plus one i into i plus 1 then we will close the bracket now let's run the program the value of n let it be 2 the sum is 8 means how it is 8 at first it will be like a 1 into 2 1 into 2 it is 2 only plus next time it will be 2 into 3 2 into 3 it is 6 6 plus 2 it is 8 so the answer is 8 even we can try with a big number also so let's try it 5 the answer will be 70 so this way we can do this type of pattern program just you have to understand the pattern and like that way you have to form the formula or equation so only this part is important for this type of program the remaining part will be similar means nothing will be changed here the remaining part is same only this part you have to change it means which where i have written sum equals sum plus i into i plus one that part so if you practice it and if you ha have uh, some basic idea about algebra and all you, <coughs> you can easily make the equation and i have already shared all the answers of question bank you can check it from the videos and even one solve question paper of hafil examination that also you can what's from my playlist or even you can check the link in comment section and if you have any other questions which uh, you may find difficulty to solve it you can give me in telegram or even you can write in comment section i'll try to solve it thank you for watching see you in a new video till then take care and bye